All right. Hi, everyone. It's Rebecca and Dr. Martha, and we are so happy to see you virtually. We have been uh, enjoying being with ourselves, learning a lot about ourselves, as I'm sure most of you have too. And what we have noticed about ourselves is that we are holding our breath. It seems a common uh, problem, predicament, just the way life situation is right now for us to be holding our breath. And what I'm going to show you is a way to get the jaw to relax, just a little bit of getting the jaw to relax. So if you take hmm, second, third, fourth fingers and place them right at that jaw hinge, and you'll feel it because when you put your fingers there, oftentimes the jaw hinge goes, oh, thank you for touching me. I didn't know that I had so much stress here. Because as we hold our breath, for most of us, I can say for myself, I have a tendency to earn your jaw, kind of lock my jaw into place, which is uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. So if you just give a few little clockwise or counterclockwise or take your fingers up by where this cute little inside lobe is of your ear, I know it has a name, can't think of it at the moment, but that little part of your ear, and take your fingers and just kind of come over that jaw hinge and a little bit on the jawline, then come back up, massage, and bring it down. So this time we'll take an inhale i don't care where the inhale goes it can be in the upper part of your chest which is where we hold our breath oftentimes anyway so inhaling through your nose and the exhale is drop your jaw and let those fingers come down from around the ear and that temporal uh, uh, the temporal mandibular joint or the jaw hinge is what it's called and again inhaling in through the nose and the exhale is oh, well bringing those fingers down at that jaw line. Mm. helping the jaw to let go that's great. That's a great physical exercise. Now today we're also going to do a breathing exercise. We're going to say four syllables. Om, ah, eh, and eh. So we will show you. You're going to just take it a breath and then om it out and a breath and ah it out and a breath and eh and then another breath and eh. And you know physiologically, believe it or not, on the inhale, you actually activate one of your nervous systems for relaxation, the SNS, and on the exhale, the PNS. So really an inhalation and an exhalation, especially a little deeper one, helps relax your central nervous system. So since we feel like we've been holding our breath, we're wondering if other people have to. So today it's gonna to be about the breath. All right, so the first one, we're gonna inhale, Oh. Ah. Now, no worries if you're shorter or longer. Everybody's different. Rebecca is a singer, so she can probably be like oming twice as long as I can. It's okay. We all do what's, what we can do. Okay, so let's do it once more. Oh. Ah. 
And you know, if you can do that five times, it'd be great. Uh, it just really does activate your different nervous systems to help you be calmer. So that's yeah. it for today. Yes. May I ask a question? Absolutely. Okay. So I was wondering on the O and the A, ah, does which part of the nervous system does that activate? It's the inhale and the exhale that activates our nervous ah, system. Okay. Okay. So the, the SNS and the PNS, the let's get excited, let's get relaxed part of our central nervous system. It's the, in, the physical inhale and the physical exhale that does Okay, it. I just wanted to make sure. Yeah, no, the om, ah, eh, eh is our sounds I've learned from uh, a, a Korean way of breathing. And they always say, by the way, end with a smile. Because uh, the smile is important, so. And a smile is important, that internal smile. Yes. So closing our medicine bowl to you, the practice for you. Left hand on the heart, right hand on the heart. And repeat after me, please. With great respect and love. With great respect and love. I honor my heart. I honor my heart. My inner teacher. My inner teacher. And you take that honoring for yourself and share it with others. All right, everybody, good to see you again. Take care and stay safe. Stay safe.